Okay, well, we're on part three now. Thank you for watching. Uh, we've got, you need to stay to the end because we're going to get the money shot at the end, but this is, we didn't anticipate it being this long, but it is, so let's get to it. With the tape measure, it's kind of hard to get perfectly accurate. So I'm going to burn an inch. I'm going to put it at three and a half here and mark the one and then go over to six. So now instead of Instead of trying to get it perfectly accurate like this, at the tip, I'm burning an inch. I put it there, burn an inch, now I've got exactly what I need. sink bit here to taper ever so slightly on the very top just to help me start these little nuts that go in there they're like I don't even know what they're called wood insert nut. I just know what stuff looks like. I don't ever know what the titles of stuff are. I just know what it does and I grab it. But I'm going to put this insert in here. Glow, That's glow what red. I'm talking about. Sweet. Boom. Got freaking time. Got it. <laughs> What I just did, what I'm doing here, I'm working on a frame basically to go under the tabletop. So the, the tabletop will mount to this and that will keep the tabletop flat, nice and neat. Because what I have here is inch and a half thick uh, oak, solid oak. And everything else out of this table is made out of this alder. So um, the oak will keep it nice and straight. So I'm making a frame here. So it's just a just a big a frame. This will go under the table. Um, and what I'm going to do, I'm going to use these boards here inside like this on each side, and the trestles will mount. The trestles will mount to these.
Um, one of the ways that I use to flatten tabletops out is a lot more different than a lot of people. Um, but what I use is a big 7 inch angle grinder with this, uh, I, I bought this at Harbor Freight. This is a DeWalt brand so it's nice and sturdy. But I bought this pad and the sandpaper at Harbor Freight. And so it's kind of a little gem that you can get at Harbor Freight, these big 7-inch backer pads with the, the sandpaper. And it's just 80 grit, and I use it to flatten tabletops out because it's fast. I don't have a lot of patience for the hand tool work. Okay, so we got the table made, the breakfast nook cabinet made, and it is actually both installed, and you'll see that here in just a little bit. Um, but now we have to build the bench for the other side of the table. So that's what I'm making now. I'm working on the two trestle ends for the bench. So they wanted the bench to kind of match the table. So that's what I'm working on now at the bandsaw. <laughs> Versus the I didn't attach this to the walls yet because I knew I needed to do a couple of little bit of touch up stuff and add trim and all that. So we're going to pull this out um, and I have 
there's an outlet back here. I had to cut a hole, make a notch while I walk around, but we have a really long drawer. And so the outlet was in the way of the drawer. So I made a mistake and didn't get this kind of a plug, this flat to the wall kind of a plug. And so the plug that I have in there is sticking out a little too far, so the drawer is kind of hitting on it. So I need to swap it out with this. And uh, so that's what we're doing now. We just need to pull this out and swap that. And um, yeah, it's just kind of a lot of digging around in there trying to get it done. But yeah, that's what we're doing. It's already unplugged. <laughs> Much easier. <laughs> Taking a nap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be way better. Oh shoot, that's better. Oh, where's that? I can get you. Because I don't think it's necessary on this part. Let's keep that caulking in. How about that? Keep that caulking in. Caulk. Yeah. Ing. Yeah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Hey guys, thanks for sticking to the end of this video. Uh, thanks for watching the whole series, actually. This trestle table turned out really awesome. I really like the bench, really love the table. Really like the little breakfast nook bench as well. Um, thanks for watching. Please hit the subscribe button. We're gonna be doing videos like this. We're gonna continue to do videos like this. Hopefully it won't be near as long, um, but we're learning as we go. So really appreciate it. And um, please comment down below. Let us know what you think. Appreciate it, bye.